Okay, where the heck are we and what's up with the big huge castle that looks like it's 2 billion miles away? How would I know? All I know is that this place feels strange and not a good strange. Is the vent still there? Maybe we can try to get back into the attic. No, once they fell out it just disappeared. Plus, even if we did go back, we'd have to deal with those creepy skeleton things, which I'm not up for. Okay, so we are basically stuck in this random place we have no clue about, and we are probably going to end up dying, right? Tegan, we're not gonna die, and I'm surprised you're so freaked out right now considering you usually seem to be the one who knows what to do. I just... I'm freaked out. What even is this place? What's gonna happen to us? Okay, stop asking so many questions. We should really just focus on getting out of here than what is actually in this place, okay? <sighs> for a second there, when you were giving that little speech, I thought you might have actually manned up for a moment. Yeah, whatever. Okay, so how do we get out of here? M -m maybe I could help you, young children. Who are you? Why? I am the old hermit who lives here. Can you help us? Oh, why yes, Jack. Come with me to my house, and I shall help you with your quest. Are you crazy? That dude is super creepy, and he's probably going to kill us. He is kind of right. Just this once. He isn't going to. He's an 80-year-old man who doesn't seem to know what he's even doing, so the chances of him grabbing a knife and stabbing one of us is pretty dang slim. Do you want to get out of this place or not? <sighs> Fine. So, what can I do for you? We got stuck here and we need to find a way to get back home. Ah, I see. You see, the only way back home to, well, wherever you live, is through all the lands to the castle. And what's at the castle? <laughs> You'll figure it out, my child. Okay, you creeped out yet? This guy's insane. Zane, shut up. So, do you think you can help us get home? Why, of course, child. For a price. But we don't have any money or pretty much anything with us. That's fine. I just need a deal that I will get a favor in return for helping you get back home. And whenever I ask you to do that favor, you must do it. What do you want us to do? Mow your lawn, water your flowers or something? It's a deal. Alrighty then. Here is your map you must use to get to the castle. Go through all the four lands, and something at the castle will help you get home. Each land has a force field you go through to get to the next land. Make sure you don't leave anything behind that you need. Once you go through, you can't go back. Be weary. It's not going to be a, let's say, fun journey. Alright, thank you. Good luck! You'll need it. Tegan, we should have been discussing this together. You can't just decide for us. Do you have another idea of getting out of this place? No, you don't. This guy probably knows his way around since from the way it looks, he's been living here for a while. This is our only chance of getting out of here. Fine, but it's not going to be my fault if this guy ends up getting us killed. Whatever. What's that sign say? Good night, jungle. What, you're saying good night to the jungle? Oh! That's what it's called. Sorry. Does anyone have a bad feeling about this? I'm sure it's fine. What could possibly happen? Hey guys, look at those flowers. I think I'm gonna check them out. They look familiar from one of the books I have on flowers. We can't stop to sniff the flowers. We need to keep moving. Zane, just let her look, okay? Oh, so now you're taking her side just because of the whole hermit thing? Guys, stop. No, I'm not. I'm doing it because it already sucks that we are out here, so just let her do some research on her flowers just for the heck of it, okay? Jeez. Guys, stop it, okay? We can't fight with each other like this. We need to focus on getting home and not on things like hermits, okay? Now, I'm just going to go check out the flowers for a bit. She's right. We can't keep fighting like this. It's stupid and childish. I'm sorry for not letting you in on the hermit situation. Fine. I forgive you. This place gives me the creeps. What? You think a flower's going to talk or something? Zane! 
Riley, cover your ears. What? Cover your ears. The flowers are hit. Oh no. I don't know what to do. There is nothing here that can cure hypnosis. Wait. Those flowers I was looking at can? One sniff of this and they'll be up in no time. Ew, what is that smell? No time for questions. Cover your ears and help me get Tegan awake. What is that? Run! Let's go! Just need a breath. Okay, I think we ran past all the flowers. What did they even do? They put you under hypnosis and it made you fall asleep. So I had read in the book before that the flower I was looking at actually made hypnosis go away. You just have to put it under the person's nose and it will work. Well, it stunk, that's for sure. Okay, I'm good now. What are those glowing things over there? <coughs> Run! Go through! I'll grab it! Thank you for getting that for me. Sure. Alright, lovebirds. We got it now. Can we just forget that happened? Oh my Mira, lovebirds? Seriously? Never mind. It looks like this is a lake. A really big lake at that. How are we gonna get across? Look! Over there! We can use that canoe! You do realize that that thing is like a billion years old and probably doesn't float, right? It's worth a shot. Yeah, we may as well be. It's not like we can cut down a tree to get wood for a raft or anything. Alright, everyone hop in. Okay, who knows how to work this thing? I do. Seriously? Yes, my dad and I go out on our boat at home all the time. I know how to do this. Well, alright then. Guys, do any of you feel anything under your seat? I kinda do. Do you know what would live in this lake? I do. I would say... Alligators! What do we do? We can only hold this up for so long! Quick, in the boat. You all there. Yeah, cool, thanks. Let's get them in. Who the heck are you? My name is Bahar, sort of the idiot. Where are you taking us? Back to my father. We can restore you with food and supplies since the alligators ate them. Father, I saw these animals out in a canoe getting attacked by alligators. They need some food and supplies if- I handle it! They go to village. Chief have big dinner. Oh hey! He wants us to have dinner with him! He doesn't want us to have dinner. He wants us to be his dinner. Guard, tie them up! You be breakfast, you be lunch, you be dinner! But what if we don't want to be lunch or- QUIET! What are we gonna do? 